Hey guys, uh, today we're playing a game called Dead Plate. I don't know what this is, I'm going blind. I saw that a plushie for the game uh, got to 600 or something percent sold within the first day of the plushie being out, so it must be good. So we're just gonna see what's up with it. New shift. Uh, tutorial. Oh wow, you actually showed up for training. On time, too. Barely. This is highly sought- This is a highly sought after position. Be grateful you're even getting the benefit of being told how to do your job. Your resume showed many, many jobs in service in three, so I assume you already have some of this down. Though I'm choosing to ignore the rate at which you got in your positions. Hey, having 28 service industry jobs over the course of 7 years is pretty impressive when you think about it. Even less impressive when you think about it for five, more than that. But with those jobs, you likely already know how to see customers go to the counter and get some sleep over your table. Keep in mind how many people are dining. You don't want a large group in a private area. Nope. I can walk sideways. Get one for two, please. Uh, seat them. Yeah, get to the seat. Keep them here. Good job, they'll take a moment to see what we're serving today. Once they're ready, they'll put their menu down and we'll go check, on, check in on them. First, what we're serving today? Yes, patrons don't pick what they eat. Instead, we have a strict menu that changes daily. You'd know that if you read the interview. I had skimmed it. Hmm. Oh, they want, they want stuff. Yo! I like an appetizer. Once you have their meal ticket, bring it to the marker between the window and the door, or now it's into the kitchen. Cooks will start work on whatever order you have right with a mildly prioritized in the desert. Dessert, side, stage, meal, and appetizer in that order. No, that's to distract me with the cooks taking too long. Uh. Nope. Alright. Once your orders are finished, you'll find it at the window. Order and bring it into the customers. Got that back there. Hello. Take it. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, Pfizer. Cool. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Once they're done with the RR appetizer, they'll ask for more ones to go back over. Don't keep them waiting long. A main. Okay. Main. Two mains. Got a main. Can I get two mains? Okay, that's kind of lame. All right, and you. I'm so good at this. Once they're ready for the bill, go behind the counter and check them out. Okay. Here's your money. Thanks. Ooh, two hundred. Most customers will ask for the full course of appetizers. Sides, meat, meal, and desert. Once they're done with their meal, make sure to clean the table. I don't want guests to leave us down the open. Wait, how do I clean it? After the inspection from this side? Okay. Trash is full. Right now, I'm the table. Okay, so the trash is probably full. Come back to the kitchen to check. The garbage will be in the right of the back door. <laughs> yeah, seems like it is. Can't clean the table in it, mean. Since there's nowhere for the scraps to go. The trash and bring it out to the alley and just throw it out. I got you. Oh hell yeah. Alright, I'm in the flow of this game. Nah, I can clean this up. <laughs> no. I'll only take this next customer on your own. Alright, let's go, let's go. You. Yeah, you got you. Well, come on. One table. Appetizer. Got you. The food. Nice. Do you have a go box? Is there a way you order ahead of time by any chance? Yes, we do. Ah, I. Nice. New. But we don't have go boxes. No. 
Bruh. No, thank you for the correction, Chef. I hope you're around to correct you when it opens, so make sure you actually know what you're talking about next time. Right, yes, Chef, but what should I do if I don't know what the answer is? Everything you can not, not to look or know that. The convenience is their money. If you guess the time, as long as you make it look like you know what you're doing, and don't promise today we won't want to do um, Main got you. Let's take it for Rem leaving. What? Ugh, did that one leave? They're probably expecting fast food bubbles to be anyways. We wouldn't want them coming here. The good news is that is they still have to pay for what meals they did eat. But on the off chance a respectful customer loses their patience and leaves, they will likely won't be leaving any tips and won't be paying for any further meals. In your best interest not to, not to let that happen. But that did leave you with a dead plate. Oh, they said the name of the game, World Threads. Unless, even though we're only in the tutorial. Unless another tip wants that exact order, you're stuck with it until you throw it away. Perfect good meal gone to waste. Bring it back to the trash can. Took it away. Good work. Some other things may come up, but for now, you seem fair enough. We'll be opening in just a moment. Are you all set? Start the shift. Go. Start. Thank you. <laughs> now that you're properly trained, and you're ready to start actually working. Here's our menu for the day. If you need me, I'll be in the back. Good luck. Alright, I'm gonna solo this game. Appetizer. Appetizer. Tip for one. Yeah, this is an appetizer, right? You want, you want this? Good for you. Because that's what you're getting. What do you want? You want dessert? It cannot be that hard. My money. I broke the money cap. I'm so good. Yeah, I'm the professionalist waiter, so don't even, like, try me. I'll just be shimmying until the shift is over then. Hell yeah. I fucking aced that. Day one should complete. We're in green onion rolls. Oh, yo, that place is nice. Sword wardrobe. Worn out guitar. On the ground are scraps and pieces of luck flare than the lyric he wrote for. Should really finish right in these. Holler, who's her? Yo! Where the hell her is? Let's guess she's busy. Womp! Horse. Well, it's like be like four or three times, you gotta work with it. Interesting. Nice view, eh? On the couch. Save. Uh, and day. Sorry I'm late. Sorry. Sorry doesn't cut it. It's only your second day and you're already... Why do you look like that? I, uh... I thought uh, biking really fast through the rain would drive me as I go. Turns out it soaks me faster. Dry off. I can't be seen my customers like this. You do know umbrellas exist for a reason, yes? I don't own one. one. Bring your mind for the ride back because it doesn't happen again. Oh, uh, thanks, but uh, then how are you gonna be mm, gonna be getting home without one? I live here. Like, in the restaurant? My apartment's upstairs. Oh, oh yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Wow. Is there a problem? Nah, it's just, isn't that worrying? Like, this thing happens to the building, it's all gonna be gone. If you have enough time to talk nonsense, then you're ready for work. Okay, gang. An appetizer, great. Uh, you want a maid, right? Oh, and then you also want a maid. Oh boy, it's getting a bit confusing. Can only assume you want that. Wow, okay, this is a stress. This is a stress test of a game. 
Thanks for the money, money, money. Oh yeah, my shifts are easy, bro. We good? You were in blueberry crate. Alright, caller. Yo, answer your phone. She's still busy. Okay, well that's kind of lame. Lamp. Oh, it's playing like some very hard to distinguish audio whenever I check the TV. Probably means something, but uh, doesn't mean enough for me to care. Alright, uh, it's 1 a.m., so I'm gonna end that recording session there. Alright, gang, we're so back. Welcome back to Dead Plate. Oh, la la la, recording session 2. Last time, uh, cooking. Not cooking. We we uh, we're, we're we're a waiter, not a cooker. Uh, a chef. Text to me inside dessert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Table for four. Oh, jeez. Now that's a lot of work. Oh, we like an appetizer. All oh, fucking yeah, four of you. Ow, what? Ah, it, no, I'm sorry. There's something in the trash. Came it. It ripped the bag up when I dropped it. I think he cut me. I swear I didn't throw it away anything I wasn't supposed to. I don't think. I can clean up the mess. I'll just need a second. Youch. Anime! You don't need to worry about that. Someone else will get the mess. Let me see your hand. I can't be serving the customers with this. Try to be more careful next time. Right. Well, okay. Don't know what that was about. Give me your order. Meanwhile, I get over here. Bang. Day three shift complete. You've earned squid and pasta with shrimp. Hooray for me. Calling time. Call her. <laughs> Guess she's busy. Still, will he just keep on reading them? Burn the house down ending. Cut the window. Nothing. And a lot of the carrots in the day. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's time for another day. What was this? Your body starts feeling itchy. Press C to try and scratch. Oh, yeah. What? I'm itching. Huh. No, that's weird. We got them knives. Let's -a go. Y'all, yeah, yeah. You got it, you got it. Let's go. Hey man, let's go. Y'all gonna pay? Y'all, y'all, y'all gonna pay, right? Y'all. Yeah, that's what I thought. Pay up, pal. I'll take out the trash. What? Uh, I guess I'm not taking out the trash. Who the hell do you think you are? Huh? I apologize, Jeff. Uh, sorry, doesn't fucking cut it. No, does it? You think a dish like that is at all acceptable in my kitchen? No, Chef. Then why do you make it? I know, Chef. I must have. You don't know. It's my mind. I apologize, Chef. The flower had been left near the stove. I didn't want it to get burnt. Don't back talk me. In my own fucking kitchen, damn pig. Plan on being a semi decent cook, you have no conceivable reason to be scared of something like a stove. Get burnt, you keep cooking. If you can't follow full safety regulations, it'll be your own damn fault. Yes, chef. I couldn't hear you. Yes, chef. I need a break. Go back to work. Okay, let's go take out the trash. 
Or not, that's illegal. It's a rat. A rat. Give me a little cheese. Sorry, we had a little bit of a thing. Back to the grind, baby. Hey. Yeah. You're doing great. You run strawberry shortcake. Uh huh. Oh, okay. Yeah. That was cake. I really loved how cake that was. Hey, Colin. Guess she's busy. Still, yep, we're just gonna put a rat with its stomach cut open in our fridge. Seems reasonable. Cut the window. Can I interact by sitting while looking out the window? Nope. End the day. I'm red again. Why can't I you try and move? Oh yeah, I'm moving. I'm moving. Rody. Blah, who is Rody? Never get harder. Maybe one day we'll have to deal with three whole table. I wonder if there's any kitchen beef going on today. Oh my god, three customers. Okay, okay, don't panic. For the epitome of working hard. Fuck you too then, I don't know. Oh yeah, you want that. Man, these guys are gonna leave, they can fucking forever, cook faster. We'd like a shide, yes, take shide. Great, can I talk to a little lot over here? Hey Vince, I wrote. Jesus, you look terrible. Did you get any sleep last night? I had a nightmare. Yeah, tell me that's the thing. Uh, you got a favorite fruit? Not really, no. I thought be non committal. Well, there's not much that I can really pick from. It's not an answer. Then I guess the lemons. Like lemon pie? Lemon tarts? No, just lemons. How can you stand just seeing raw lemons? Aren't they sour? I wouldn't know. I don't have any sense of taste. Yeah, I can see the decorations out there. That gotta do with it. Not. No, I lost my ability to taste the food once okay. Whoa, what, really? No wonder your food tastes like that seems to be miserable. Cook. What's wrong with my cooking? Uh, or nothing, sir. What about you? What's your favorite food? Do you have to pick one? That sounds pretty non committal. Alright, alright. I guess I eat whatever my girlfriend's into. That's also not it. It's still better than lemons. Never mind. Back to the grind. Sorry, I was having a nice chat with my, um, psychopathic ball. Thank you very much. Yeah, I win. Oh, hey, I'm... I'm out past hour after... Uh, after past hours, hours past, and I'm out. After hour. The noise seems to be coming from the freezer. This well used ashtray. Handwriting is awful. This week's newspaper. Oh, there's a 
view of the bistro. There's a lengthy description of the food that Vince has annotated with notes and recipe alterations in response to. The week's menu showed promise, however, I couldn't say the same for the service. The staff I have been weighing on my table have been incredibly unprofessional and brash. While this may have been a one off incident, it was surprising as I was accustomed to Lagway the Saturn and the staff being more than professional. And I fear it may show us in taste and refinement from the hiring process the Bistro is known for. Vince seems to have scribbled out the entirety of the notes about the waiter. Newspaper clippings of a restaurant view from a few years ago. It's overwhelmingly positive, and the critics seem excited for the future of the bistro. A photograph of the bistro on opening day. Cabinet. So the recipes, tax forms, ingredient lists, etc. Looks like he does all the budgeting himself. Trash can. Trash can. Wait, is that? There seems to be a couple of love layers and endearing notes thrown into the trash as well. All of them signed with an M. Okay. Snooping around. Oh, what? Okay. You don't earn the crook? I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. Those look like flies. I think they are. Huh. Got the window. Nothing new. Wait, hold on, was that something? There's a person in the window over there. Is that always there? I can't remember. I never really paid attention over there. Collar. Yo. She's busy. Still. Nope, I forgot to. I was gonna save by accidentally hit end day first. Nope. Where am I? Why can't I see anything? Press. Oh, I didn't press it in time. Oh, I'm in an oven. Huh. Bomb literally cooked, bro. Table for two. Table for one. Well, I have just the table for you. Eh? Okay, this is getting uh, kind of crazy mode right now. Fuck, dude, I barely even. Ah! This game is actually starting to feel like a job. Yes, please give me my money. Okay, this is fine. You just want that, right? And then, then you want desert? Yeah, 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 yeah. Trust, trust. I know the process. It's going great. Now you're desert. Oh, bro. Like we're all, we're all good, right? Yeah. Oh, I'm so good at this job. Friend, fresh lemon tart with a non-symmetrical thing. That's kind of annoying. Damn you, Vince. She's busy. Still, got the window. Oh, the the person in the window is gone. Okay. So that was a one-time thing. Alright, it's day-ending time. Oh boy, hold on, gotta be ready for quick time events. Youch! Bruh, man, it's not cool, bruh. Okay, the grind only gets harder. Table for one, I got you. Table for four, that's kind of lame. Kind of cringe even. Meanwhile, 
want the main, right? Nice. Oh, I am cooking. Wait, do you not want this? Am I hallucinating? Who wanted this? Oh. I didn't I didn't even have it in my head. Where my boy wins at? Dessert, yes, your dessert will be going straight to you on this fine day. There you go, gang. Extra cleanliness. 800. Dude, we are cashing in. I quit. Pardon? I quit. I, uh, you said this was a temporary replacement for someone, remember? I know I'm supposed to give you my two weeks, but you've been seeming pretty antsy and uptight lately, so... You're probably wanting someone more qualified for the position. Well, the position is still available if you need. You sound fairly desperate when you first asked to work here. Yeah, now you don't need to worry about it anymore. Do you like the meal at least? Huh? The, the leftovers. Oh, I'll re-eat the rest of the night for sure. It's pretty bitter though. Right. Have a good night, Rody. You too, boss. This should be enough. Hey man, I know you, you said we should take a break and all, but I was thinking maybe we could get there somewhere. Your choice, I want to say sorry and... Your call cannot be connected. Please call it again or try again later. Goodbye. Bruh. Hey man, hi. I tried calling earlier, but I didn't. I don't think you were at the phone. I was wondering if you wanted to get dinner. It's casual, but you could go anywhere you want. Money's no problem for me, so... Your call cannot be connected. Please call again and try again later. Goodbye. Man, hello. I need to know if you'd want anything to eat, to eat anything. I'll well, get dinner with you. It's alright. Your call cannot be connected. Please call again or try again later. Listen, I forget the dinner. Can I, can I just hear your voice? I haven't picked up a phone even once the past week and I just need to know you're there. Goodbye. That's it? Oh, I clearly missed something. There's no way that's just it. Anyone? Tail for one. You for a grilled hanger steak. Huh. Okay. I'm gonna end recording session two there, but I'm sure there's more endings as it said ending one. So yeah, I'll come back to this and uh recording session three which will probably be about well right now for you back to then play to recording session three. Last time we um ending. But uh that was kinda lame. So this time I'm just gonna be uh more thoroughly checking everything. Oh uh, what? Oh Hole in the wall. There's a hole in the wall. Interesting. Read through catalog. Oh, this is new. Collection never <laughs> magazine for gourmet living. I've heard that page turn sound somewhere. Does that not sound familiar? I swear to God, put that page drink sound for. Oh, this is where we buy stuff. I beat the entire game without any of this last time. Introduction. When Jeff Vince, I'm not saying that. So I'm just saying Vince opened his innovative restaurant at, at uh, the turn. It has grown to steady success among older, more classically refined patrons. However, 
six years of its opening. Uh, it's remained in modern dining location despite many initial concerns of its monthly rotation as many grew up going stale as a form of temporary dining. Despite the dining experience being consistent, critics have no recently noted a drastic shift in employee numbers. I asked another changes. I have pride in my location not only on what I can personally bring to the table, but on the tail and passion my work can provide. I asked what his thought process of maintaining the show's well known standards was like with a noticeable low of employee numbers. Not only do my customers deserve good service, but my staff deserve a firm job was best utilized in efforts for to put the waste. My hiring process reflects that. Waiter, five dollars an hour. Wow. That's me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey Vince, can I ask you something? Chef. Right, uh, Chef. Alright, if I ask something, something. I highly doubt you have enough free time on your second day here to be talking to me this much. Yeah, but I'm bored. Besides, I don't see you doing much back here. Supervising cooks are supposed to prepare my dishes for perfection. It's even slightly off from how I'd make it. I'd step in. That seems a bit harsh, doesn't it? Starting to interrupt your questions, but do you know asking me so many questions this sort of doesn't reflect well on the outlook of your job, right? Eh. Alright. Let's see, uh, let's look at this hole in the wall. It's still a hole in the wall. Oh, there's a mouse trap. Is that where we, uh, got the mouse for, uh, that special meal? And yeah. Hi, Vince. Hey, Vince, can I ask you? Vincent Rody. Right, Vincent, can I ask you something? Come on. So about you smoking here. Are you supposed to be smoking in the kitchen? Why wouldn't I be? It's my kitchen. Right, just doesn't that bother any of the cooks? They smoke me all the time. Never mind. Uh, you have any leftovers? Do you have anything you can cook without your place? Nah, even if I did, I'd be a terrible chef. Anything I touch just ends up burning. I guess maybe you should try it. Just make some sort of cooking. Maybe a peanut butter and jelly is more on your level. Are you kidding? There's a way out of my league. Last time I tried making one, no. Oh, all he was left was charcoal. Uh, how am I doing so far? You haven't gone fired yet, have you? As I know of. You're doing fine. Sorry, lads, I was talking with my psychopathic boss. Cat! There's a cat! There's a cat! There's a cat! There's a dog! There's a cat and there's a dog! There's two cats! Two cats? Nice. Let's go talk to my psychopath manager. Boss. Are you single? Why do you ask? I don't know, I was just curious. I mean, you must get a lot of ladies, right? Sure. So aren't you seeing any of them? Look, I'm really not getting what you're taking for here. Well, I guess just, why are you here? You just stand around watching other people work most of the time. You don't actually cook. You're more unstable enough in finances. Can you just get a manager to run the place while you relax, sell down somewhere? No, I'll run the place for money, you know. Got an actual stake here. With me staying on down. Chasing petty romances is the end all be all of life. What? Petty romances? Who is this all for if it isn't for someone else? What's even the point if you don't have a wife or kids to share with? Isn't enough to have it for myself? Yeesh. Suit yourself. Uh... Can you give me a face? Ha. Ah. So is that a no or... Oh, right. Yeah, that's a no. You're not gonna raise. Ah. Why do you need one anyways? Well, it's for a girl. Her name's Manon. I should have just enough by the end of the week, but just a bit more to be ample. Really special. Make a tip to get your job done, and you'll do good enough for whatever, you, whatever pet project you have outside of it. So, why do you need this much money, anyways? If you really like this cash, of course not. Well, I mean, a little, yeah, but she's not prissy or anything. She's worth it. Every cent of it. She's worth all of it. I'm like, sure, just how much she means to me. It's all you worth too. Hmm. What? Nothing. Do you like your job? 
I've dedicated my life to making this bistro as successful as it is now. Yeah, but do you like it? What do you mean by that? Well, for someone who claims they're a proud owner to specify, I would actually, you know, see you cook. What about you? Me? I mean, it pays me money? What do you want to be do before this, then? I doubt you want to take tables for a living. Wait, wait, wait tables for a living. Well, I, uh, I guess that was... I guess was study school thing for a bit. Oh, what were you going there for? You're definitely gonna be fun of me if I told you. You don't need to be too worried about that. It can't be any more embarrassing than you are right now. Yeah, see, that kind of talk is exactly what I mean. And I got this cutscene. Hi, Vince. What are you doing out here? Hey, Vince. What do you want? Uh, you know, what was, um, that? What, 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 what was that about? Vince? Hey, Vince. I wrote... Jesus, you look terrible to you guys. Alright. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh... Can I have a break? I'm getting kind of tired. Why, do you have to wait for lunch? It's more so because of the... Never mind. Um, no, I didn't. I couldn't afford to bring anything. Hmm, I suppose I could let you eat the leftovers of patrons and finish their meals after all. Really? You're being serious? Sure I am. But you better enjoy those meals more than the censored. Customers didn't appreciate the table scraps and bothered to feed you. Your shifts over all these dishes better be useless fucking spotless for all all these, these meals are going out of the paycheck, right? Hi, right, sir. Uh, what are you reading? Restaurant reviews. What does it say? Didn't mention me. Didn't mention me, no. Not damn, they don't appreciate good service. It's not. Okay, gotta, gotta go. Money. Yeah! Aced it! I stole cash from the register. What? Oh, I didn't know I could do that. Just theft? I don't got much time left here. That to be crumpled up love letters. Oh, sign with an M. Sign with an M. Wait, Manon? Don't tell me. Don't tell me. We have competition, don't we? The catalog. I am rich. Okay, hold on, I gotta be prepared this time. Press left. Got it. That didn't change anything. I'm still getting cooked. Whatever. My boss is gonna kill me. Literally. Oh, hi. There's a hole in the wall. Yeah? Hi. Clean it up. And the money. Nice. So, what now? I quit. Pardon? Quit. Yeah, yeah. You've seen this? No, this is just the same ending! How do I get the other ending? <laughs> After close examination, uh, uh, I got the wrong thing, since I didn't fucking ask him what his favorite food was. Oh my god! A phone call! Hi, hello, man, is that you? Pardon? Oh, Vince, sorry about that, I thought... Never mind, what's up? Are you free tonight? Uh, I'm hosting a dinner party at my apartment. I was checking if you'd be available. Oh, that's what you meant. Wait, you're inviting me? Is that a yes or a no? Uh, yes. I well, sure, but before that, I wanted to ask you about. Be there in the next few minutes. Click. I guess I can just ask in person. I guess we'll save here. This feels like walking to a mouse trap. Maybe I should just ditch and tell him I got into an accident or something next morning. 
Oh, good, you made it. Oh, hey! Yep, here I am, in flesh. Wow, super stoked to be here. Wouldn't want to be in any other place in this fine night. The only tax so excited. Come in. Right, uh, pardon the intrusion. Wow, this place sure looks, uh, well. Your taste in interior design never goes anywhere, I guess. Hold on a sec. Where are. I thought you said this was a dinner party. It is. And why am I the only guest here? Guest? Yeah, I'm supposed to be your guest, right? Pfft. <laughs> no, I'd find someone to care for them when they arrive. Wait, you called me here for work? The dishes are in the, uh, the kitchen counter. Go fetch them and ask around if anyone wants them to get here. Nothing here, I may work for you, but I'm not some kind of your pet dog. Besides, I'm actually here to ask you about... That must be the... Um, were you saying something? Yeah, alright, fine. Play of Scargo. Okay. Hello. What's with that look? I guess they're waiting for their plate to catch their eye. This guy's been staring at me for a while. I look familiar. Can you be. No, no, there's no way. about you? Yes, I'd like that one. He's supposed to take care of them. Who are you supposed to be? Uh, a waiter. And you're serving more of that. And what's that supposed to mean? What's wrong with it? Look in the mirror and it'll speak for itself. Well, whoever you are, either your Vincent must be getting desperate with tenants and sort of taking a like to you. He usually doesn't invite anyone that's on your level. My level? Wait, what do you mean by it? seem to have already dismissed you. Ah. Cheese! Nope, that was a black screen for a second. Didn't see it. And I have something to... Off the guests? Yes, you do. Ah, I guess I'll try again after I finish this chore. Let me take one. Just have to take care of them. So how do you end up meeting with it anyways? Uh, through work. Oh, so you're a cook there. Not exactly. Uh, where the? You could say that. And he, and he convinced you to come and hand out snacks? Is he even paying you? Wait, oh my god, he's not even paying you. Well, how about you? Where do you meet him? Oh, through university. He went to school? What was he like? Not much different. Quieter, quieter not as harsh, let's say. What do you mean by harsh? You don't think he? You don't think you're snooping too much, do you? How do you think Vincent would feel about you asking this? Yeah. Um. Hmm. Oh, what's this? What's that dish? You should quickly care of them. So, what's your favorite thing about the chef's food? Uh. How it looks? It looks appetizing. Appetizing. Or, or appealing? Is that what I meant to say? Like, in an artistic way? No, oh, that makes much more sense. Yes, I agree entirely. I'm gonna be honest, this food is, uh, well, it's fine, but it doesn't taste genuine. Like, it feels incredibly self-absorbed in a way. It's not made for others, you know. Like, what is it? What well, a chef is supposed to do? Does, does that make sense? Well, it's nice. Isn't that what makes him great? Never mind. Your voice is pretty loud, by the way. Yo, Chef, can hear you, right? Wait, he can? Brody, is that you? Huh? Who said that? You? I thought so. It is you. It's me, Richard from class. Oh, uh... You can't remember. I think we were majoring in hospitality, too. Right, ah, right. All is a bit fuzzy for me. Stop thinking after a while. Do you switch majors? Well, I, uh... Flunked out. Oh, yeah. Kinda assume. We? Hmm? Everyone in class thought you could keep up for long. Your poor parents, how they take it? They must have been really disappointed, right? It was really surprising to see you again. What I really want to know is how in the world did you end up working for someone like Chef Charmin out? Revenge. 
You get on your knees and beg him or something? Huh. I gotta go piss. Fine. I need to piss real bad, like right now. You could have just said the bathroom. Okay, bye. Yeah, let's go. What is this place? French, French Snyder's Untitled. Toilet. I was lying, wasn't I? Open. Typewriter and some paperwork. It's a bit too quiet. Paperwork seems to be related to running the bistro, but his handwriting is pretty unintelligible. Shelves. Culinary degree is framed on top. Hey, what's up with that? Who <laughs> was. Why was somebody uh, looking? It's. Now can we talk? What's gotten you all, all worked up? Fine, let's hear it. How do you know Manon? Who? My Manon. The what? news picture you have in your office. The one who's been sending you letters. My girlfriend. Are you sure we're thinking of the same girl? I saw the picture. Of course I'm. That man it said she dumped some pathetic red haired fluke a week ago. If that, I'm not sure if I said that word right. I never heard that word in my life. So it can't be the same one. Well, yeah, but. Stay out of my office, Rudy. Harm. Huh? It's a bedside table inside. You got freezer key. Oh, the key to the freezer in the restaurant. Oh. Looking for anything specific? Yeah. Um, yeah, it's just... Uh... Looking for the bathroom. And did you not make you check the door closest to the kitchen first? What other door? You don't have to serve the other guests anymore. Come on. The person's gone. The music is just cut out now. Where did everyone go? The party ended. What? That's this early in the night? Something came up. Is everything okay? Vince? You better go home. You have work in the morning. Alright, my last day. Well, thanks for the party, I guess. Good night, Vince. Good night, Rody. Oh, yeah. Ouch! That hurts. What's the flip? Oh, we have the key to the freezer. Can we just go in? Inside. Yes, I'm sure. Let's go. Huh. Oh. Oh god. Hmm? Men. Oh. Another save. Uh huh. Shit, 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 shit. He, oh god, oh god. Struggle or struggle? Uh, you know, this is a pretty tough choice. I'm gonna have to go with struggle, but on the bottom. The rope's too tough, I can't break it. Struggle more. There's, there's a sob I wouldn't be able to reach the handle with my arms like this. Fuck, I just have it on me to cut or burn through it. Get away from me. Don't come any closer. Stop. Stop. Calm down. You don't have to be doing any of that. Stop. You're ending up in the same place no matter what you do. Ugh. Actually, you know what? 
maybe if you're fast enough, you'll get out. Hell, I'll even give you a 15 second head start. Really? You, you do that for me? You mean it? Mm, of course. Go on, go! Oh, I got this! Can't even bother her hurry when your life depends on it. How disappointing. Damn. Okay. Uh, I'm assume I'm assuming we can do a bit better. Ending two. Best served cold. Woohoo! No, now it's cold on the menu screen. Okay, it said we didn't have anything to burn through it. So, because the matches didn't do anything, but matches are like burning, right? Mat matches burn? So like, possibly, maybe. Yeah, 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 same. These matches, yes! Aha! I need to get the hell out of here. I'm not touching that. Mainly just fresh ingredients. Some balls of cooking oil at the top. Is that? No, it's just beef, I think. Seems sharp. It's mainly preserved food. Oh, but the coal is up with the shelf. Something usual in the shelves. I can't climb up this without flying out of the Cleaning supplies, all of them are carefully labeled with a note reminding to keep them away from any food. Dice the flour, bake them. I got flour! Yeah! It's locked. It's too cold. I don't think I have the strength to break the door open. You have the fucking key, don't you? Industrial. Ah, that! Industrial control. Oh, gone. Don't want to get too close. Or something right now. The meat? Got meat sauce. Ah, you cut down to the bone. You got animal bones. Place flour in your shelf. Okay. Oh, I can step on top of it. Place bone in the fan. Oh. Yeah, I'm not as cold anymore. Break the door down! Z. Yeah! I'm so strong. Oh. This place looks more red than usual. Oh. No Vince eye. Oh, there's a plate here. A dead plate. Oh my god! Roll the credits! They said the name of the game! Looks like a, a grilled hanger steak. Vimps! Hey, maybe we can talk about this. Wait, don't come in closer. Oh shit. Ow! What the fuck? Nah. Nah! You. You. I don't even know what to say to you. How do you ever think of making food out of. Is this everything you cook? Do you even hear yourself? No, that's disgusting. I would never serve anything like that in my kitchen. But then... Why her? Why? Why you do it? What reason would you have to butcher her like that? Well, I wasn't planning on being the one to eat it. Who the hell is gonna eat it then? What did she ever do to you? Why did you kill her? Because you... Yeah, you were supposed to enjoy it. What? This was meant to be for you. But you refused to eat it and now you've gone and wasted it. Was, it wasn't for me. That's, that's, an, that's fucking insane, you know that, right? Besides, you never told me your favorite food. Why me? My ear. You ate my ear. Well, don't flatter yourself. It probably would have been better cooked. So you do eat people? No. I can't stand eating. No matter the ingredient, no matter the recipe, everything tastes the exact same. It tastes like nothing. It makes me sick. But with 
With you, maybe. What? Hey, gang! Gang! Yeah! I'm gonna juke the shit out of you! Window, 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 window. Hello? There's a peephole looking at the restaurant. He got the shattered wine bottle. Oh yeah, I'm gonna smack this bitch halfway across the face with that. Come on, bitch! Oh. Ah. Uh. Ah! Damn. Youch. <laughs> you got restaurant key. Hey! Woohoo, what a nice day. The love of your life. On a plate. That's dead. Full credits. What, do I want- Do I drag him into the freezer? His eyes are still following you. You got cooking oil. Uh oh. Oh boy. We're about five minutes at phrase six this motherfucker. Oh yeah. I should get something to eat. Damn. Hell yeah. Oh. I don't think I can keep doing this with you. Wait, what? Just this, it's too much. And not enough in all the wrong places. I, I understand we were... I thought we were doing good, what happened? But nothing happened, Ruby. Just give me some time. You might be in the job on the after at this place. So I'll get enough money. We can get somewhere nice, I promise. Rody, is it the apartment? I'm saving up for a nicer place, really. Rody, man, it's not your apartment or our dates. It's I can't keep watching you and ruin any semblance of progress you make with yourself while trying to make me happy. It's exhausting. But you aren't ready for a relationship. You're killing yourself over for me, and I can't have you spending money on someone you don't need. I. You mean well, and I do love you still, I really do. But until you can learn to care about yourself, it will only do harm for the both of us. And I... I'll see you around, Rudy. Okay. <laughs> Best served hot. Yeah! Skin on the cake. Okay. Damn. Burnt down to the ground. Okay, what if we let when uh what if we let Vince catch us? A dead play <laughs> Come on, catch me. And how long have you known her? You never answered how you know her. There's no point in dodging the question now, right? There's not much else to fucking hide. Long, it's some long rift, a short walk home before you master the job. She showed passing interest in me, but it was interesting. It felt, it felt like an obvious rebound. Uh, it wasn't until after you gave me your sob story, crying for you. More particularly, when you showed much desperation and sacrifice for this girl, that I realized you realized that she was part of the recipe you were looking for, and you weren't even willing to try it. Do you care about her? Really in that. She looked really happy in that photo of you. The that photo of you crashed in your office. How could, could you. Do you even care? No. So it was just some sick game you? Didn't even love her? But you did. You cared so deeply about her. She didn't even mention you. You loved her. Probably still love her. With little or no possibility of her loving you back. Don't say that. Don't. I was inspired. You totally don't. 
and love which the sentimental meaning was for you in the culinary world. I'm a professional chef, not a parent making a meal for the kid. But I think I understood what they meant when you walked in. That, that, that one cook. Just the reduce to all your employees? Is that is why you have so few staff members like the magazine said? What? Th that one cook, the guy just disappeared one day. Jesus, yes, he was fired. Why couldn't you have done that to me? Why didn't you quit? Because, because of her. This was all for her. You knew that. You knew that damn well. Ah, right. How could I forget? It's all you ever talked about. No wonder she left you. You're exhausted. Shut up! You disgust me. I still can't believe you were planning to feed me something like the guy in the food you've been giving me. You haven't? They're all just sitting in the fridge, yeah. I don't need to try them to know when they don't taste like real food. You always made me lose my appetite, you guess now no, I know why. Do you regret it? Why should I? You're the one that asked for the job. You're rotted. You'll never be satisfied. Vince, listen, just listen. If, if everything else so far has tasted nothing to you, what makes you think I'll be diff any different? If you're really doing all this just to taste again, when it turns out it looks just like any other, what will you do? You would have killed her. You would have killed me for no reason. Are you really ready to deal with that? If this is your idea of trying to make yourself happy, I don't think you'll ever be full. Okay, we just need to fill a quick time event. Do it! Bite me! Bitch! <laughs> oh, that's not biting me, that's stabbing the fuck out of me. Get in. Meowch. You burned coal fired heart. Yeesh. Well, I think that's all the endings. Great. Well, uh, that was Dead Blade. That was really fucked up. But uh, I liked it. It was, uh, yeah, I don't subscribe, I guess. For more stuff. Eventually, bye.